All right, our um, tip of the week is quick layers. Um, this is something that even as a long time ARCHICAD user, I definitely learned this too late in the game, but it has completely changed how I work modeling. And so I'm really excited to share this with you. So what quick layers are. First, let's learn how to get to them. It's a palette that we pull up um, and it lives, it'll live in our toolbar up top or you know, you can drag it to wherever it's easy for you to see. But just like all of our other palettes, we go to the window, go down to our palettes fly out there. And at the very bottom, right below the blue beam, um, we have our quick layers. So by putting a check mark next to the quick layers, that turns that toolbar on for you. And what that toolbar looks like is kind of just what you see on the screen there. We can quickly switch between hidden and seen layers. So if in one view I want every I want a certain number of layers hidden versus seen, I can switch back and forth through those. Same with locking and unlocking layers we can show just the layers we have selected and turn all of their layers off, or we could turn all of the layers that we have selected off and see everything except for those layers. So here's an example of when we have turned everything, when we've turned a layer off. So as you see in this example, I have a mesh selected. I'm not gonna be working on my site plan in this, and but I still want everything else that I have seen. So instead of going through my layer combinations and trying to find the one that fits this, I quickly just select my layer, hit the closed eyeball under selections, and that's going to give me what's on the right hand side over there, which is everything except for the mesh that was in that view before. And we can alternately do that by selecting our mesh. I only want to work with the mesh. I don't want to know anything about the house while I'm working with this mesh. So under the other layers, I click the eyeball there and that turns everything that is not on that layer as the mesh that turns all of that off. So now I'm left with just a mesh. <laughs> 